right so it's mental health week this week and we're going to make a mood jar and i think i sent um, a picture of a jar to your grown-ups last week so hopefully you've got the jar ready mine's only a little jar i'm hoping you'll have a bigger jar than mine when you make yours but i'm going to show you how to make it and then you can try and have a go of your own and i love these because you can put absolutely anything in these mood jars so i've got loads of bits of things to put in okay so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to pour some water in the jar i'm going to fill it up not quite to the top i'm going to put it to about there and then you might have baby oil but i'm going to use this clear glue so you can use either so it's either glue or baby oil i'm going to squirt some of the glue can you see what's happening to the jar it just looks so good because it's mixing with the water i've put quite a lot in there okay and so when you shake it up it's going to look fantastic now it's up to you you can put some color in the water but it looks better i think if it's not too dark because if you put too much color in the water you won't be able to see the lovely things that you've put in so i'm just going to put a tiny see i've done too much there going to put a tiny drop one drop in there so not a lot i'm making a mess of my hands and i'm going to ask you you ask your grown-ups because they're going to make it really tight because we don't want it all coming out but can you see i've only put a tiny bit and it's already made it quite um a dark blue so if you put too much and you're not going to see any of the super things that you put inside it so i'm going to open it up I'm going to put some things in. So I've got some glitter. I'm going to add some glitter, just a little bit, like that. This is the fun bit, this. And I've got some little toys that I'm going to put in. I'm going to put these in, these little toys in here, like this. And I've got some feathers. I'm going to put feathers in. I've got to squish them right down. I'm only going to put one feather in, I think. You might have a bigger jar to put more things in. And I'm going to put some sequins and i've got some bees i've got all kinds of things so you can look all around your house for all different lovely things to put into your jar i'm just going to squeeze lots of things into my jar and then it needs to be like i said really really tight really tight and if you shake it up oh, look at that my fantastic mood jar and bit like a snowstorm but what's really good about these is sometimes if you're feeling a bit worried or you're feeling a bit angry you can sit and look at those and they'll just calm you right down okay but it needs to be on really really tight so make sure it's tight and if your grown-ups have got glue they could perhaps glue it on so that it can't come off at all and you might want to tie a ribbon around here or you might want to decorate the top but don't decorate around here because you won't be able to see the amazing things inside. So have lots of fun doing this activity. And I can't wait to see your jars.